Good evening, Dragonites, and uh, this is going to be the first unboxing video that I'm going to do tonight. Uh, I'm going to do this one real quick, and then I'll uh, go ahead and roll on to the second one. So, uh, for those of you that follow on Twitter, um, at DD Custom Mods, I posted a picture of this package and kind of had a guessing contest. Um, we did have one person that actually guessed correctly that it is a um, mechanical keyboard. Um, but wasn't quite sure about who or which keyboard it is. Um, but if you've been following the logs or following Twitter at all, you'll notice, know that uh, our newest sponsor for the desk build is Nanoxia. And they were gracious enough to send, instead of a drum roll, we have the sound of cutting cardboard. But, they were gracious enough to send us to use for the build a Encore Retro Aluminum Keyboard. This thing is so amazing looking. It takes me back to my middle school days um, for my typewriter classes. Yes, I'm that old that our typing classes, we had typewriters instead of computers. Um, but this is absolutely amazing. I'm not waiting for the desk to be finished to use this. I'm actually gonna go hook it up probably tonight um, before I go to bed here in an hour or so. Um, but yeah, I cannot wait to start using this. Um, my wife actually got excited when I said, hey babe, guess who's the newest sponsor and guess what they're sending us? And I showed her a picture of the, the keyboard and she, she was like, sweet. <laughs> Which, that's about the most excitement I get out of her when it comes to technology and computer stuff. Otherwise, she just rolls her eyes at me. But yes, um, so keep an eye out on Twitter. We're going to, you know, get this hooked up. I might do a short video of just kind of, you know, it hooked up and all lit up um, on Night Shark upstairs. And it's just going to be great. I'm going to get some pictures. I'm going to post some pictures. It looks so much better in person than it even does in the the pictures. Man, pictures do not do this thing justice. And it comes with a little cleaning brush, as you can see there. And then this little tool here is for pulling the keycaps off. Um, so you can clean it or change them out or whatever the, the need may, may be. So I'm not going to lose that. Um, yeah, this thing is... Ugh. Pictures just don't do it justice. Absolutely love this. Cannot thank Nanuxia enough for uh, sponsoring this keyboard for the desk. Um, I was I was so afraid that we were gonna be stuck with these horrible little peripherals um, for such an awesome. Oh, pardon me, it's like 11 o'clock at night. I am past my bedtime doing this, but. Because I love you guys. Um, but I can't thank them enough. I, I was really afraid that we were going to be using basically really horrible peripherals. But this keyboard is really going to take it to the next level. And I couldn't, couldn't be any happier. Um, I'm going to try in this video to remember. Um, as you guys know, I do forget sometimes. But posting a link of where you can actually pick one of these up for your own. Um, this is really nice. Um, the only other mechanical keyboard I've had experience with was the Thermal Take one that we use for Project Military Tech. Um, I'd say weight-wise, it's about the same. Um, the aluminum feel of this compared to Thermal Take's plastic outer covering. Like, it, this has... Um, it's, it's aluminum, so I mean it's got metal all the way around instead of like a plastic edge. Um, it feels a lot more clean, um, a lot more solid, um, but weight-wise they're about the same. Um, on the back we have the normal flip-up feet for those that like an angled keyboard when you're typing. Um, I'm a little mixed. Um, usually I keep my keyboard pretty flat though.
but this is pretty awesome. It's it's probably going to take a minute to uh, get used to um, the round keycaps with the space in between like this. But it's not too different than some of the, the bad Dell computers or something like that where the keys actually came to almost a point and there was a big gap in between. Um, I like that there's a big shift key on the, the left. Um, I hate the keyboards that have this little tiny shift button. Uh, so, f but loving it so far. But as I said, uh, keep an eye out on Twitter uh, and Facebook. We're gonna post, you know, probably a, a video of it hooked up and of the light and maybe some use or something like that. Um, and then pictures, of course, lots of pictures. <clears throat> as I get to use it bef while we finish up the desk. Um, and if you're wondering about the progress of the desk, um, then check out our next unboxing video that we're about to record. And that's the one for Mod My Mods and Alpha Cool. Um, and you should get a sneak peek at what the desk looks like. At least it kind of looks like a desk now, instead of just a, a weird wooden shape. So hopefully uh, you'll check out the next one and uh, leave me a comment, like, subscribe if you want to see more tech, if you want to follow the build and see what else we do computer wise. Um, other than that, I will leave you with a, just a gorgeous last look at this before we take it and hook it up. Um, you guys have a great evening and we'll catch you in the next one.